my channel if you are new here i am emma and this is dress my curves you can also find me on instagram we are fat we are sassy and we are full of self-love today we have a boohoo haul but not just any boohoo haul we have an all black everything boohoo haul i work in a salon um until recently i was doing mostly work from home and i am now doing more hours in the salon and of course our uniform is black let me just tell you a little something about myself i do not wear black i feel like i look a little bit weird in all black because I, I it's just strange to see myself wearing that a few years ago my entire wardrobe was pretty much all black and then i started this whole self-love journey and was like hang on a second i don't have to wear black because i'm fat and it's slimming i don't care about looking slim and i also don't really like black I'm gonna wear colors and patterns and vibrant things and florals and stripes that go horizontally and defy all of the rules that plus size women have to stick to in order to look slim. Slim is not my goal, so no thank you. Anyway, roll around a few years later, I literally own maybe one black t-shirt and a black pair of high-waisted jeans and I don't wear them together because I just don't do all black, but now, I have to wear a lot more black. So I went on to Boohoo and I stocked up. <laughs> so that leads us to the following items. First of all, I got this long sleeve bat wing, super comfy, oversized kind of tee that I could just tuck into everything or leave hanging because it is quite long and oversized. I'm a fan, I love a bat wing sleeve. It's nice and comfortable without being too small. Okay. okay, let me start that again. I like that it's super comfy. I do find long sleeves quite restricting, but this one is great. Then we move on to my jeggings. So these are super high waisted and I love them. They're ripped all the way down the legs, but the ribs are really small. They're not um, huge and open. Like they're just little slits that go down to about your knees and they're not too daggy. I love the ripped jean trends, but some of them I'm like, oh, are you really gonna wear that out in public? Do I sound like my grandmother? Yes, I do. There is such thing as too much ripping and these are just the right amount. They are a jegging, so they're not super thick and supportive. There's heaps of room in them. Nice and stretchy and comfy. Love them. So next item is just this oversized um, tee. Same principle as the Batwing, but it's obviously got shorter sleeves. It's just really comfy and soft and stretchy. These don't last forever. I've had these t-shirts before. They're good for the season. And then after a few washes, they kind of start getting a bit um, daggy and baggy, but they don't cost very much and they're comfortable. So again, this is a really nice length actually too. It's more like a, if you are shorter than me, you could totally wear this as a dress. I'm pretty sure I upsized on this. I'll have all the items and sizing listed below, but I feel like I upsized because I like the oversized look. Um, and I would just tie this in a little knot on the side and wear it over my leggings or jeans or leave it out baggy. And you could even rock this with like stockings and thigh high boots, possibly. But for work, I'd just leave it long and wear it over my leggings, maybe with a waist belt or some kind of detail there to kind of break up that black on black on black on black on black. It's taken me a while to get used to it, okay? Okay, so this one is marketed as a dress and it is 100% not a dress on me, but I do love it as a long top over my jeggings or a pair of tights. It is very high necked. Like I wore this to work the other day and I did find myself kind of pulling it down a little bit every now and then, but that's fine. You just have to make sure, like you do notice when it starts riding up again. But I really love high necked stuff for work. Because I have big boobs, it's hard not to be exposing if you're in anything that's kind of below here. I, I can't do anything about it. That's just how big my boobs are. I don't, I can't, <laughs> I can't tuck them away. Um, so anything high necked is great for me for work because I don't have to worry about when I lean over, um, you know, showing my cleavage or um, my top kind of sliding down and being a bit too exposing. This is fantastic. It has a tie waist belt here. Hopefully you can see that. That really cinches you in at the waist. It's got these great bat wing sleeves again and this crossover front. So this is, 
this is why it's a top on me because it's way too short to not wear tights underneath they do also have this in heaps of other colors i actually really really like it i might get a brighter color to wear like outside of work because i just really like the fit and the style of this it's really flattering the back's longer as well so it will come down over your bum the back i could do as a dress definitely the front definitely not might just stand a bit closer so you can really see that waist detail it just gives you such a flattering shape. I really like it. It's conservative, but sexy because you can still see your body shape. Okay, I've just thrown the Batwing um, shirt back on because I'm going to show you some bottoms. I'm going to tilt the camera down. Um, I've got a few to show you. The first one being a pencil skirt. So I'll just tilt the camera down. Okay, so this is just a pencil midi skirt. It's one layer of fabric. It's super stretchy. I just really like the length on it. It's like an actual midi skirt on me, which does not happen often <laughs> um, it's just got an elastic waistband it's just really fitted it's pretty thin but I would wear it with something a bit longer over the top I wouldn't wear this like with something tucked into it because it is a bit see-through so something like this over the top with a little knot tied in the side it's just a nice little like professional looking easy stretchy skirt to throw on so next up we've got this gorgeous maxi skirt which i just love you might have seen it on my instagram in my celebrating my 5k followers post actually i think it was this exact outfit maybe with the t-shirt i was on my way to work um so this is amazing it's really long it's really flowy it hits the ground on me which again doesn't happen often because i'm tall there's heaps of fabric i did find it get in the way a tiny bit so i actually tied it up in a little knot down the bottom to just keep it off the floor a bit and wore it kind of like this for the day which is super stylish and really easy to do if you're having a bit of trouble with a lot of um, excess fabric on a dress or a skirt little tip it's got an elastic waist heaps of room tons of fabric i definitely could have gone down like two sizes but that's okay it's still great i'm still gonna wear the heck out of it i love it and last but not least we have these gorgeous culottes that i absolutely am obsessed with the only thing i don't like about them they've got pockets but the pockets are like they're tiny like that's it you can fit like up to your second knuckle in there that's fine they are so comfy they're really flattering they're a great length they've just got the tie waistband sorry my shirt's all tucked in so it probably looks a bit lumpy um they've got this gorgeous tie waistband and an elastic waist with heaps of room again they go really well with pretty much anything and they are so comfortable i am all about the comfort for a work day so stylish and comfortable it's a yes from me okay guys that wraps up our boohoo all black everything hauls i really liked everything <laughs> I hope you found something that you really like that you can wear to work whether you work in a salon space or the beauty industry or even a corporate space some of these items would totally work in a corporate setting you don't have to spend a fortune on corporate clothes these are really affordable options so don't be put off by it being boohoo you don't have to spend a million bucks to look a million bucks you know these are really accessible pieces of clothing that would suit an array of different careers and environments and black is going to be one of those things that's forever timeless just because it's not my go-to option anymore doesn't mean that it's not great you'll notice on my page i don't feature a lot of black clothes and that's just a personal style choice but now that i am working at the salon more and i do have to have a black uniform it's just something that i'm gonna have to get used to and I, to be honest i'm not mad at it i do really like that streamlined like very professional sleek all black look it's just new for me thank you again so much for watching my video don't forget to hit that subscribe button and i will catch you in my next one Mwah.